You're welcome back. This is News File is your most authoritative news analysis show. And uh, this morning, my take, you will have to read it later on myjoyonline.com. And I deal with an issue as part of my contribution to the NCCE's continuing education, a civic education on how we ought to, uh, what we ought to pursue to get the Ghana that we deserve. And I title it, We Fail Ghana If We Don't Hate and Punish Lies. If We Don't Hate and Punish Lies. I simply take you through the Constitution to um, show you where there's a duty on us that the Constitution and its framers had an ideal that this country should represent. And in that ideal, they expect that setting norms, cultural values, and customs will be encouraged and even be part of our formal education system so that we'll be people who do the right things and are honest in the way we conduct our lives. I've written once about, uh, and many times really, about you know, the, what I said was the danger uh, that morality we was getting into in this country now. And then I s also take us through the, the, the criminal you know, law to show how we even uh, got to criminalize telling lies and being dishonest about how you conduct uh, life in this country. And yet it does appear that not even the biblical injunction where people die for telling lies and even here where potent deities you know, uh, make sure that people, are, people die for telling lies will scare us. And I show you why in my almost 20 years of interaction, particularly with uh, po political leadership and political commentators who dominate uh, media landscape, they are a big failure in not helping to uh, engender that kind of uh, culture and conduct in, in us when all of us are to blame, really, for the things that go on. And I show that for some of the politicians, that conduct of being dishonest and telling outright lies is simply a default to them. It doesn't come to them as something that's a difficulty to do. There are some of them, but there are some of the very finest ones who are very sincere that we also need to acknowledge. So on my journal line, you get to share my take. Thank you very much.